Hmm? <laughs> hey, oh. hi, you're right. <laughs> hi there. Uh, go on, uh, sorry, ladies first. Um, hi, um, I'm Shayna. <laughs> Shayna, nice to meet you. I mean, at least we're both a similar level of punctual. Yeah, and I was worried I was going to be late. I hadn't really figured out how to use this dating app. Join the club. I just downloaded this thing this morning, so... Mm. <laughs> um, so, uh, I don't think it's wrong, but you're from up north, right? Yeah, good, good spot. Um, from Leeds. OK, but your, your profile said that you live in London? Yeah, no, I do. Um, my parents moved down here a couple of years ago to be closer to their parents. So, yeah, but needless to say, the house was a bit of a downsize. One second. Sorry, 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 one second. No, it's all right. You go ahead. Angie? Neji? OK. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, it's um, OK. You didn't hear that, did you? Literally not a word. Well, well, was it about me? God, no, I don't tell my parents about guys that I'm talking to on dating apps. Oh, wait, so you're living with your parents during lockdown? But you're, you're a frontline nurse. How, how is that working? It's not ideal, but um, I could have gone to a hotel, but I thought I needed to be closer to them to make sure that they're all right. Yeah. I kind of just self-isolate. I come in through the back and, and just come straight to my room. OK, so no contact whatsoever, basically? Nope. Just nice. that shouting that you heard. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? Um, you work in healthcare, don't you? How's it for you? Yeah, I do, but um, it's sort of easier for me because I live alone. And how are the hours for you? I mean, uh, preaching to the choir here, but horrific some days. But that's what we're here for, right? This is, um, this is the first day off I've had in, I don't know, like, about four or five weeks. You're joking. Well, listen, I... Thank you for choosing to spend some of it with me. Likewise. So this living at home situation, how long has that been going on for? Um, forever. OK. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I really get on with my family and, well, I'm actually just saving up for my own place and, well, like, for in London and on a nurse's wage, that is just absolutely going to take me forever, so... Yeah, so I'm living here for the foreseeable future. But listen, I just have to say amen to it because, yeah. But how is the saving going? Eh? Really, really, really well, really well. Um, I might just be able to afford a cosy cupboard. <laughs> uh, but I'm actually quite good at saving. I just, I just like the odd luxury, like anyone else. Oh, OK. Such as? Such as um, trainers. I'm always on my feet all day, so I like a comfy kick. No, it makes sense. If you're walking around loads... And listen, you have to... I feel like you have to spend your money on something. You've got to enjoy it somehow. Especially you working probably incredibly hard, so... I mean, I've got loads. <laughs> so, you live on your own, right? Yeah. Are you renting or do you own it? Well, sorry, either way, it looks really nice. From the bit I can see. You like... <laughs> you, from the bit you can see, you like... Yeah, the bit you've tidied up for this, it looks really good. This place is so extortionate, though. I mean, my, my landlord's eased up on the rent during lockdown, but it just eats into my bank account every month. I don't know how you do it. Like, all my friends had the same issue at your age. Like, the struggle is real. I won't be able to do it. Hats off to you. Yeah, it's... Again, I'm just... Some people don't have a roof over their head right now. No. And so, I mean, I'm one of the lucky ones, regardless, so... It's true. You know. So, I figured I'd just address the elephant in the room. There's an elephant. Well, hopefully I'm the only one that can see it. How do you feel about the cougar sitting opposite you being three years your senior? <laughs> OK, uh, it genuinely makes no difference to me. What about you? No, there's no problem on my end. As long as you mature and you're not expecting a sugar mama. <laughs> OK, no, 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 that's reasonable. No. Have you ever dated someone older? Or, like, what age range do you actually date if there is one? You're delving in here, aren't you? Uh, gosh, I haven't really... don't think I've considered it too much. I have, actually. Um, so it's kind of nothing out of the ordinary for me. Can I ask why it hasn't worked out? No, sorry, sorry, is that, sorry, is that, too, sorry, is that too direct? No, no, not at sorry. all. No, not at all. Straight to the point. I, I like that. Um, gosh, these questions are tough. <laughs> Making you think. Sometimes relationships, they just run their course, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, I hear you. It's like, no-one's fault. Just, just 
naturally happens, I guess. Bingo. Yeah, it wasn't out of malice or... I mean, hopefully they weren't seeing other people. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, yeah, just things just tend to fizzle out. I mean, that's kind of been my experience so far. Yeah, um, that makes Hopefully sense. I can change that in the future. But yeah. Any time will tell. Yeah. <laughs> Um, Jenna? sorry, Jenna? one second, sorry. It's all right, go for it. Jenna? Yeah? Calm down, calm down, Jenna. Can I, can I give up? Kitchen, go please. Okay. Okay, bye. <laughs> that should have gone off for a while. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, where was it? Okay, sorry for the chat escalating so quickly. Oh, no, my goodness, that's all right. Small talk is boring anyway. I just think it's stuff that should be out in the open, you know, from the very start for both of us. So, now, now, look, now you can interrogate me as you see fit. <sighs> OK, all right, I won't do that. I'm not going to grill you, but there are a couple of things that I was wondering. One thing in particular. OK, go for it. Something about your profile. I, I noticed there was a baby in your profile picture and I don't, I don't think you <laughs> delivered it and I was wondering... Do you have a baby? <laughs> OK, every guy on dating apps, like, mentions that. I actually should take it down. <laughs> I just love it so much. So, obviously, he's not mine. OK. Um, it's my baby nephew, Ashish, and I just love him so much. Bless. And, oh, so, the, so you've got siblings? I've got one younger sister. One. She got married quite young, actually. I'd say 21, I think. I mean, that is quite young by today's standards. It's always her prerogative to get married, mm. whereas mine... Less so. Less so. Uh, I mean, was that a problem for your family? Not a big one, but as the older sister, all the extended family now see me as the spinster. Sure. So the pressure is still there, but it's just background noise. Yeah. And, you know, having said that, my biological clock is ticking, so there is... No, sorry. This conversation... No, this conversation is not getting... No, spinster. you can't Apologies. dig into me about this stuff and not... Dig... You've got to say some stuff too. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. Fine. Too... No, it's too serious. OK, cool. All right. That is so rude. I'm so sorry. Listen, you have a free pass to be tired, all things considered. Oh, you know what's been keeping me sane throughout the whole of this? I've been making myself a cocktail every night. So um, I basically come back from work, sneak into the kitchen, make myself a really good cocktail, sanitise everything, drink it, and then it just knocks me out. Uh, you listen, you got to love a little ritual, right? I've actually become quite the mixologist now. Have you? Better with vodka, whiskey and gin. Nice. So, what's your favourite out of those? <sighs> what actually would I make him? Hmm, what would you make me? Which one would I choose? OK, what's your... What could you do with gin? If I went gin, what could you do me with gin in it? What could I do with gin? A lot of things, right? But actually, okay. there's a really, really um, classic British cocktail called Bramble. A what? A what bull? <laughs> a what bull? Sorry, sorry. A Bramble. Okay, a so bramble. you've never had a Bramble. No, yeah, okay, bramble. no, never okay. had it. It's actually super simple. So you have crushed blackberries, a bit of gin, lemon juice, nice. a tablespoon of sugar syrup, uh, ice, creme de mer, and a slice of lemon to garnish. Uh, that does not sound simple at all. <laughs> no. uh, it's perfect now that summer's rolling in. Ooh, sounds nice. Well, trust me, that would be very gratefully received these Shana? days. Shana? Sorry. It's nearly 8 p.m., Shana. Time to go and clap. Oh, sorry, it's nearly 8pm. I'm going to have to go outside and do the clap for the NHS. OK, likewise. Yeah. I, uh, I hope you had a good time tonight. Yeah, I did, thanks. And you too. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Bye. OK, cool. Whoa, quick answer. Hey, mate, I've been on tental hooks for this debrief, man. You were just waiting in bed for me to call you, weren't you? Bro, stop deflecting, man. Details, details. So, Shayna, frontline nurse. God bless her. Yeah, like, really had all her stuff worked out, and she's a bit older as well. Ooh, experience, lad. No substitute for it. So, good day. OK, if I was to be honest about it, it it's just too early to tell, I reckon. OK, OK. 
okay. It sounds like there's still something in it for you, bruv. Yeah. No, 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 there definitely is. Yeah, exactly, man. It sounds promising. That's what it sounds like. It sounds like, you know what? You can win this on aggregate. <laughs> you found anything else about our online? Uh, no, I didn't even get a surname. And that would be easy if she's NHS. Well, let me know what you find. Uh, Shayna Saha? That could be her. Okay, let me check to see if she's on socials or anything. Um, Shayna Saha. You get what you need? No, there's actually nothing. Ah. Not on social media, nothing. No. Damn. But listen, thank you for your help, and I'm gonna get some sleep and I'll catch you tomorrow, yeah? No problem, bro. Have a good one, yeah? See you later. Good night. <laughs> Callum, are you serious? You're doing a hit session without me? Yeah, no time for slackers, mate. All right, fair play. Um, I have a second date tonight. Nice. With who? A uh, Shayna, the nurse. Ah, oh, poor her. Having to deal with the pandemic during the day and then deal with you in the evenings. <laughs> yeah, we're doing one of those um, those quiz activities on the app. Oh, hey, don't embarrass yourself, you know. Yeah, listen, you don't need to worry about my general knowledge, all right? Anyways, have you lot chatted otherwise? We haven't, but that's understandable, right? Yeah, definitely. She must be so busy right now. Consider yourself lucky. Mm, yeah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna let you carry on with whatever it is that you're attempting to do. Uh, good luck. Uh, <laughs> I'll catch you later. Uh, Come on. Come on, I'll call you after. Hey, no, 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 no. You must be the first guy ever to be stood up on a video day. <laughs> Shut up, man. Hey, no, hey, no, no, seriously, yeah, seriously. She must have been, like, called in early for an emergency shift or something like that, man. Yeah, but she could have just messaged on the app or something. Ah, oh, come on, man. She must be mad busy, mad rushed. Or, or she wants me to take a hint. Bye. Mm. I guess that might be true, I suppose, yeah. No, no, sorry, you're not supposed to say it. You're supposed to go, no, 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 that's definitely not true. Hey, hey, do you want the truth or do you want, do you want me blowing roses up your ass? What do you want, truth or roses? Exactly. Roses, please. Yeah. <laughs> Shayna, hey. Hi. You're right. Hi. Um, yeah, look, I want to say sorry for yesterday. I got called into work on an emergency shift. Listen, I, I, I kind of guess, so it's cool. Yeah. Yeah, still, still, but I'm sorry and I hope you weren't too inconvenienced. Oh, my goodness. No, not at all. Um, how are you? Are you okay? Yeah. Shattered. Shattered, but good. Are you looking? Shattered or good? Good. <laughs> good. You don't look shattered at all. You look very, very <laughs> No, I'm joking. I'm not buying it, though. Um, uh, look, I might as well be upfront with you. My job has got, like, unsociable and unpredictable hours, and that's just going to be amplified for the foreseeable future, which makes it really difficult to date. So I I guess I understand if you can't be bothered with that. It's just, um, it's just a shame, because I was really looking forward to that quiz. So was I. I don't suppose you're free now. Um... Sorry, I'm just thinking about what's... Oh, no, sorry, you're probably busy. It's midday. People have things to do. Let's do it. Screw it. Yes. I'm up for it. Right, OK. What's the quiz topic? Uh, what, is it like general knowledge or...? Each other. Mm -hmm. As in us? Yep. You mean me and you, just off, after one day? Yep, I thought, what better way to get to know each other than to make educated guesses about what we're into? 
Okay, fair enough. Let's give this a go. I'm done. I think the quiz will start if I just... There will be three questions, each with three answers. You must guess the other person's answer. The correct answer shall be revealed after each question. Okay. All right, should I click the first one? Yeah. All right, cool. Okay, here we go. What is Shana's favourite holiday from these options? Oh, have you picked, yeah? you picked? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm sorry, I've chosen mine. What do you think it is? No pressure, no pressure. Ooh. Okay, cool. Are you sweating? So, are you trash talking over a quiz? Sorry. Apologies. <laughs> okay, I don't know. I'm thinking the whole family, wholesome vibe is sort of too obvious. So, maybe I'll go with... Okay. Come on! Oh, very perceptive. I feel like you've thrown together a mean costume as well. Yeah, I, I do actually as well. I go all out. I've got like glitter, sewing, sewing machine, face paint, a lot. Amazing. It's good to know. <laughs> okay, your turn. So just pick your answer and then I'll have a guess. Okay, go for it. Right. Question two. Yeah. Ooh, what is Billy's political outlook? Oh, shit. That's a personal one. Mm. Ooh, okay. Um... Boom, done. Right, I'm answering with my outlook. Let's see if they align. Okay. Ooh, ah, you a right winger. No, no, I wouldn't say that. I just say that I have some very strong views on how things should be. I mean, I think your side of the political spectrum has been doing things badly for a lot of people. OK, and I think there are very good counter-arguments to most of those views. Yeah, maybe we should probably move on from this topic of conversation for yeah, now, yeah. at least. Good idea. Yeah? Good idea. OK, right. cool, wicked. All right, I'm going to go for the next one. Come. Oh, it's a good one. OK, what is Shana most scared of? Easy. Oh, have you picked? Yeah, easy. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what are you most afraid of? Okay. I ha okay, it's got to be these then. Surely. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> nice. I hate even just talking about. Oh, they make me. They actually make my skin crawl just thinking. Of, oh, I can't even. I actually can't even talk about them. Okay. Well, we 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 no. We'd make a good team. Why? Because I yeah, I'm a good spider catcher. I thought you were going to say you love spiders and you'd help me. No, yeah, cool. You don't kill them, though, do you? No, no, I never kill them. I always catch them in like a cup and then I release them back into the wild. I don't like them, but I don't want people to get. Oh, I don't. Like, I think they're properly. What is it that you don't like about them, though? Just what? The, the legs, the look? Like, they're so creepy. What if they just come on your hair and like lay eggs in your head and they. Ugh, ugh, ugh. That's it. Dumb. This is the silly no. myth. Okay, question fine, we'll four, move question on. Four. Fine, I'm about to move on. Uh, Vinny's favourite ice cream flavour. Okay, that's a lighter one for me. <laughs> nice. Jeez, just thinking of you mentioning anything. Mm. Okay, I could have this any day of the week. There we go. There you go. Now I know you've said, now you said it. There you go. You think vanilla? What? Do, do you think I'm bland? No, no I just thought I, you. Okay, maybe. Okay, for maybe. your information, okay, I go for dark chocolate and the highest cocoa percentage. Ooh, and the highest percentage. I hate dark chocolate. There's a bit of bitterness in, in dark chocolate that I just love. It feels too grown up, even for me. Look at how grown up I am. Do you not see me? Am I not grown? No, I would have I would have thought you'd have said white chocolate, <laughs> baby's chocolate. Anyway, <laughs> actually underestimated you. OK, good. I can't believe you think I'm bland. OK, anyway, next. <laughs> OK. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> OK. <laughs> <laughs> what is Shana's favourite sex position? <laughs> Shit, I knew I should have given permission for NSFW questions. Right. Rules are rules. Right. Go on. Go on, tell us. Done. 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 You done, 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 done. You've chosen? Done, done. Yeah. Yeah. Don't think too hard. No, no, it's I'm fine. not, I'm yeah. not going to, do I? Uh, cool, OK, there we go. Oh, OK, <laughs> all right. So you're a control freak, yeah? 
Well, actually, actually, my, my favourite position isn't even on there, so I went to the one that was the most fun on that lake. What the hell are you doing out there? I, should, I actually shouldn't be talking. I, I forgot. Oh, your parents. <laughs> your parents. <laughs> and I'm just going, my bed. Oh, so your, is, is yours like a silent move? Is that why it's not on there? It's like a silent... <laughs> Maybe like a stare from across the room. Is that like your... <laughs> it's not actually a physical thing. It's like a... <laughs> as, you, as you get a bit older, you just prefer to connect on an emotional level. <laughs> I don't know <laughs> whether to be really excited about this or just terrified about this look that you do. You, don't, you mister, don't need to be anything on a second date. So let's move on. Let's move on. OK, all right, we shall. Go for it. I'll go for it. Question six. Vinny's favourite time of day. Ooh, how gentile. What are these questions? I, we, I, OK, we cannot accuse you up of not switching things up. So, polar opposites. OK. Favourite time of day. Right. Oh, this is, this is easy. You better get this. OK, if you said it's... No, if you said it's easy, I, I've got it. What? What, what you do you mean? What the do... day? What do you do that's so exciting in the day? During the... That's what... Everything possible. I mean, aside from making lunch and eating food, I'm, I'm doing work, I'm... I... Uh, well, I just yeah. actually thought that your answer would be like uh, your favourite time of day would be night time because that's actually the time when you get to speak to me. So, ah, uh, okay, it's fine. It's fine. I understand. I'm a low priority. It's fine. Oh no, see, we 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 could have spoken in the night, uh, but somebody stood me up last night. So, <laughs> touche, touche. No, <laughs> it's not as if I wasn't sitting there like a pleb, <sighs> just waiting around. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That's I completely fine. forgot. I'm so sorry. OK, what, is that it? Oh, that's the end of the quiz, yeah. OK, so what do we do? Do you find out who the winner is now? Yeah, well, obviously. Right, let's see. OK, right. I'm... Not... Oh, gosh. How many points did I get? Oh, drum roll, please. Drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. Come on! Oh, no fucking... No wit. No, Top marks. no, I'm not accepting that. I'm actually not accepting that because your questions were way easier than mine. Are you a yeah. sore loser? No. You don't like this at all, do you? You don't... <laughs> slightly, slightly. It's a little bit of gamer in me. But I actually have to say, right, I actually have to say I'm really impressed. I think you might have... might have got me figured out a little bit. Really? Hmm. Mm hmm In all seriousness, a quiz was a great shout. Well done. Thank you. I absolutely love them. I just love them. I'm a bit of a wannabe brainiac at the best of times. Always want to get top grade. Always want to be the know-it-all. But do, do you think that comes from your parents and your family? Mm, yeah. It was sort of, like, ingrained in me. And I think I'd be the same with my kids and their academics. Do you know what? It's expensive these days. I mean, if you want to go into higher education, I mean. Tell me about it. Like, my parents got off lightly with me and my sister because we got bursaries and scholarships, which... We, we wouldn't have been able to do without it. Well, listen, it seems like they did a fine job on you guys. Thank you. Do you, do you want kids? Ooh, Shana. Oh, sorry. Oh. Sorry. So a big, wow, bold question there. No, it out. is. No, but, uh, yeah. <sighs> Let me think about this. OK, I, I'm definitely getting there, but there's just so many things I want to achieve and experience before fatherhood. Yeah, but you're not, you're not... You're not far away from it? No, a few years maybe, but not right now. Yeah, well, that actually makes complete sense where you are in life. Because once you do it, that's it. You're raising this kid forever. And not that I'm old, but that's why I've waited, because it has to be the right... It has to be with the right person, in the right circumstance. Shana? Oh. Shana? Sorry. Shopping yeah. kill it, Right, sorry, I need to go for the weekly food shop and I'm not sure when I'll get the next chance because of work and stuff, so... Yeah, no, 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 I understand. Uh, priorities. I'm really glad that you were able to carve out this time for us. And it's probably best that we wrap up for now because, again, it was starting to head in a really serious direction. My bad. Yeah, I understand, it's fine. And this was all so fun. Thanks, Vinny. Right, well then, um, enjoy the rest of your day. You too, Shana, you too. Right, bye. See you later, bye-bye. 
That's cool that she made up for last night. Yeah, I've, and I've never had a lunch date before. Oh, OK. So uh, how'd it go? If I had to sum up the date, Callum, it was great. It was... OK. And the, the quiz was really fun. And listen, even though we didn't have that much time together, I think we really bounced off each other. Do you know? It sounds like she's really cool, man. Yeah, it all seems very chill and comfortable. And I could definitely see my self and her progressing. Wow, damn, you're saying a lot. It's like two dates, that's, that's a lot. Yeah, yeah. Get your thinking cap on, man. You've got some decisions to make. I do, some big ones, some important ones. Listen, I'm gonna head to bed, but I'll catch you tomorrow or something. All right, man, sweet, bro. Have a good sleep. All right, cool, man. Good night. Peace. Thank you. It is the big dinner tonight, <laughs> boy. What's on the menu? I'm ordering in something nice. You're not coordinating with Shana? I her schedule, man. Mm. You sure you're good with that? I mean, listen, for the moment, of course. Um, but hopefully once we're through this crazy period of time, it will become less of an obstacle. Elite mentality. Speaking of which, so, obviously, the third date is something. I knew you were going to say this. It's nothing. If you were on an in-person third date, you'd have to be escalating. We're not on an in-person third date, therefore there's nothing to escalate, is there? There's got to be a way to do it. OK, I'm going to play it by ear, I'm going to read her vibe and see where it takes me. Unconventional. Good luck. OK, cool. Listen, I'm going to go, but we'll debrief later, yeah? I'll let you know how it goes. Uh, give me a bell later, but... Uh, I might not pick up. What do you mean, why? Your boy's only gone and got himself a little video date tonight. Are you serious? <laughs> no. Who? With who? When? What time? Whoa, 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 bro, my bro, my bro. Listen, listen. You know I like to keep it low key with that stuff, but stay out of my business. Um, uh, listen, unlike you, I'm not gonna pry about this stuff. All right. Um, but good luck. Just to impress. Don't play video games. Okay, okay, I got <laughs> it, I got it, bro. <laughs> cool, man. I'll catch you later. Peace. Hi. Hi. <laughs> How are you? I'm getting a lot better now. <laughs> oh my god, you chab. <laughs> so, oh, what are you munching on? Oh, what? Ooh, very nice. Uh, I grabbed a takeaway too. Oh, nice. Key worker discounts are an absolute godsend right now. Discounts? Oof. I've been loading up on coffee all day long. I'm, like, wired all the time. I will be so gutted when I have to buy my own Americanos after this. And do you know what? The staff at the food and coffee places are just so supportive. It really keeps me going. My barista ended up becoming, like, my counsellor today started, like, comforting me. Oh, no. How come? Are you right? Um. Well, I just felt a little bit, I guess you'll know this, I just felt a little bit overwhelmed with everything that's been going on. I'd got quite good at dealing with um, the stuff and, like, I guess being able to detach myself from the job, but recently it's just, it's got a lot. Listen, I, you know, I still can't detach myself from everything. And if it wasn't for my friend Callum distracting me, then I'd have, I'd have probably crumbled by now. But look, I mean, look at you. You're, I mean, when you're not on the ward, you're, you've self-isolated and you're looking after your parents. Yeah, it sounds, sounds kind of crazy when you say it like that. It's literally amazing. You're honestly one of the strongest people I've met through this whole thing. And, and trust me when I tell you, I've met some badasses. <laughs> Thank you. How's your fish and chips? I can't eat. OK, I'm, hold on, let me get my headphones, hold on. Hello? Oh, yeah, I was just singing. You missed me singing. Oh, no, 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 I didn't, I didn't really want to hear this, man. <laughs> <laughs> OK, I've got you, I've got you. What have you got in your mug today? Oh, yeah, no, I'm not drinking that today. I have made myself something a little bit special. I made oh. myself a bramble. <gasps> oh, it, that, it, the bumble thingy, is that the cocktail that you bumble? picked for me? Oh, it's very strong today. 
A bramble. Yes, a bramble. Is that the one that you picked for me? Yeah. Oh, gosh, it looks so good. Is it nice? I'm not sure you can handle that, actually, thinking about it. Ah, oh, that's such a key throwback. I'm a big fan of that. Um, go on. Tell me how your week was then. How's everything on the ward looking? Um, can I can I make a special request? No work talk. Got it. No, 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 no. It's a it's a really special request. Where's this going? I really liked the um, the game date the other night. I oh, so did I. I thought it was wicked. So could we do another one tonight? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm just such a big gamer. Are you gonna... <laughs> oh, no, it's fine, fine, you're laughing. No, fine, no, 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 me. no, 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 I'm not laughing, I'm laughing, because I'm game, I'm game. You see, see, did you see what I did there? You see... Well, go on, tell me, go, go, what did you have in mind? <laughs> OK, cool. All right, so, have you got a pen and paper to hand? Yes. They're, they're the only two things we're going to need. Yeah. Uh... Boom, boom. Food out of the way. You've really planned this, haven't you? You've... No, obviously. Um, so we could either have a draw off yeah. where we have to draw each other. OK, I guess what a draw off meant, but carry on. Well, that's a good start. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, we could, um, <laughs> we could. The other option is a uh, game of consequences. Consequences? It's like a turn based game where you write a story together by thinking up different elements. OK, I'm not sure what I fancy more, though. Well, can you, can you draw? Can you be good with your words? OK, do you know what? Show me what Consequences is all about. How are we going to do this? OK, so we take it in turns to write a story element each. Then then we'll recite what we came up with. Um, it's usually pretty funny. OK, so I won't know what you write. And I won't know what you write. Chaos, I'm ready. So do you want to go first or second? As in I write the first detail or the second story detail? Yeah. Which you'll tell me. Very well listed. <laughs> I'll go for second. Is second, that's Ooh. good, yeah? Yeah, yeah, they're both great. OK, all right, cool, second. OK, so the first detail I need to write is a woman's name. OK, right. cool. Your first detail is a man's name. Any man's name, or somebody I know specifically, uh, like I've met. No, any man's name. You don't have to have met them. You could, maybe you want to meet them. Could be someone random. Done. Right, OK, um, my next detail is uh, where they met. OK, you need to decide uh, what purpose they met for. Mm, it could really change the whole narrative here. Yeah, I know. That this is where it starts to go a bit skew if This is good. Um, yes. Got it. Right. What's your next one? What he wore. OK. Right, you'll enjoy this one. What she wore? Bingo. Got it? Nice, OK. Yeah, I think I'm getting the hang of it now. <clears throat> yeah, I got mine, got mine, got mine. I write what he what he said to her. So I write that. Uh, almost there. What she said to him. OK. It's also good if they don't match up, isn't it? Like, when you get these answers, when they're just completely random. Yeah. Or, or, or we could make a sweet story, you know. That's an option. OK. Yeah. OK, cool. I got mine. And my final decision is I get the consequence. You get the consequence. You write the, the final. You chose okay. to go second, so, so I get the consequence. OK, OK, fair enough. OK, fair enough. OK, yeah. and, and so my final detail is... What the world said. What the world said. OK. What the world said about them. OK. OK. I think I got my things. So, I'll read mine out, cos I'm first, and then I'll prompt you for yours, so hopefully this works. We'll go back and forth. Yes, ma'am. Very funny. Right. So, one day, Shana met up with... The Prime Minister. <laughs> they met in a dark alley. You and the Prime Minister? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus! They met in a dark alley to... Celebrate the end of lockdown. <laughs> he wore an orange jumpsuit. She wore. Oh, wow. Nothing. Oh. He said, I get stage fright in these situations. Of course. Who wouldn't? Who, would, who mm. wouldn't? <laughs> that actually goes really well. That's a good one. That's a good one. She said, I love you. <laughs> then Shana's parents walked in. Oh, my gosh. And the world said, 
things will never be the same. <laughs> That's the end. That was good. That was thank fun. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for participating. Um, you're getting good at this whole digital dating thing. Mm, thank you. Good going for someone who's never actually had a proper boyfriend. Wait, what? Don't sound too surprised. After the shit you put me through about my past relationships on our first date... We didn't want two inexperienced idiots banding together, did we? OK, then, why the lack of boyfriend? Are we talking too high standards, circumstances? What is it? A bit above, if I'm honest. I need someone I can depend on, and I need someone who is able to depend on me. OK, what else? Someone nurturing and down to earth and... Yeah, I'd like to be physically attracted to them, but that's actually not the be all and end all. So it was high standards? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Go on then, your turn. So tell me about your perfect partner. Ooh, I don't know where to begin. Um... Oh, should we build it together? OK, then. OK, yeah. OK, so, OK, right. Um, what's more important, appearance or intelligence? OK, you can have both, you know. That was not the question, Vinny. I said pick one. Fine, OK, if I had to pick one, um, OK, I think we're going to... I think you're going to agree with this, that attraction fades very quickly if you can't have an intelligent conversation with someone. Amen to that. OK, so we're on the same page with this, yeah? OK, good. Same page. Nice. OK, so how about... how about success or principles? OK, you can definitely have both with this question. I surely don't have to... That is not the rules. That is not the rules. Strong values make for a content life, regardless of material success. Wow. That was like music to my ears. Yeah? That is absolutely what I wanted to hear. I did not expect you to say that. OK, good, good, good. Right, last one. Confidence or humour? This is a good question. Confidence or humour? Mm. Trying to think maybe what, yeah, what? Don't think too hard. Vinny, your head will explode. That's a trick question, because humour is confidence, sex appeal, and everything else just rolled into one. Right. OK, you got me there. Do you agree? You actually got me there, and I hate to say that I agree with you. Yeah. OK, I'm still letting you know that people with all six do exist. Yes, but they are unicorns. <laughs> that is why there's lots of singletons knocking around. OK, yeah, uh, not everyone can be a unicorn. Exactly. And we'd all be actually very lucky to find one compatible person to settle into married life with. So that one person whose strengths, uh, like, balance out our flaws. Oh, it's not the first time I've heard you mention marriage. Is it not obvious from the beginning that I'm looking for someone who is very serious about it? Mmm, I, I think I possibly missed that. It's just that where I'm at in life, I... Uh, I need to be sure that the next relationship that I go into has marriage as a very, very possible outcome. Mm. Where's your head out on the N-word? Marriage. Marriage. You're the first person to ask me about that in a long time. I'm at that point too. Yeah, I feel like I know my wants and my needs, and hopefully the next person I get with will be my last. So... I was wondering, Vinny, if you'd like to move off this app, because... I just think it'd be really nice if we could text and stuff. Hi. Hey, hey. Why are you whispering? Um, because my parents are light sleepers and they would not be happy with me being up so late talking to a boy, that's why. OK, so I guess I'll have to charm them sooner rather than later, yeah? I was going to say my mum's a tough cookie, but I wonder if she'd like you. Do you know what? I think... I actually think I'm pretty good with parents. I think mums tend to really love me. What about dads? Cos my dad... I, yeah, my dad's a tough cookie. No, no. See, this is where people... Think, this is where they get wrong, because you, what you have to do is you have to sit with dads and let them tell you things about their past, you know what I mean? So I, just sit and just listen, and they'll tell me stories. And I think dads are not really liking me, so...